Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Sturge here and Terra back on the channel 11 for the trophy push to Legend League. We're now we're at 5,009 trophies inside of Legend League, and I will be doing my Legend League attacks today to see how high I can get as a Town Hall 11 attacking, probably mainly Town Hall 15s. And the army I will be using to attack Town Hall 15s is this one here that I made specifically to get two stars on Town Hall 15s. I used this army against my own main Town Hall 15, and I was able to get two stars on it. So let's head out and see how I do with this army and get on to our first attack inside of Legend League. Starting with the first attack here, we're going to be attacking this Town Hall 15. Uh, I think this base design is pretty common. Uh, we're going to go from the top side with our blimp and balloons with the warden towards the end of the attack. But to start off here, I am wanting to take out the clan, or not the clan castle, the eagle artillery. But I don't think we really can because of the expos and all those around it. So I will start off by dropping the queen at charge. I guess we will drop it towards the bottom here. Starting off with that there to hopefully make our way up to that Eagle Artillery. I don't really think we can, but we will start to get some percentage with our Queen Charge and dropping some uh, Sneaky Goblins around the outside. We can drop some Archers over here. We'll drop one over there actually, and then a couple of Sneaky Goblins. Uh, a couple more Sneaky Goblins towards the top and the right side. We don't want to drop too many in that Eagle Artillery activates. We will drop our right spell for our Queen as she is getting pretty low in health. And we will actually start to create pathing for her here to head in towards the Eagle Artillery by taking down that ar uh, army camp with the Baby Dragon. We'll try to war break in and it will probably lure out the Clan Castle so we'll see what kind of stuff is inside of there. We'll drop one more here and a wall or the raid spell which does come out with a couple of balloons so we will use a poison spell on that maybe even the queen's ability as we have an electric dragon coming out of that there gonna have to use the queen's ability here in a couple of seconds to go up against that eagle artillery and taking that down as well as hopefully this electro dragon and we use one more raid spell on her here we're freezing the two expos they're up to 30 percent with about a minute and 45 seconds left we'll drop the king over on the left side and the queen it dies off from the expos and all those high targeting defenses over on the right side so we are going to do pretty good on terms of percentage we still have the king with his ability which he will use right about now as he does pop up at that tesla over there and we will war break in to allow for this uh royal champ to go down uh, it doesn't look like it will, but we are at 35%. We'll start to continue to use the Sneaky Goblins around the outside, as well as the Baby Dragons, as we don't have to worry about that Eagle Artillery as it is taken down. Air Mine over there, so you'll drop an Archer for that. One minute left in the raid. We are using plenty of time with this attack here, trying to get the most of this uh, attack here. We'll drop a, a minion down here for this army camp, up to 39%. I have to use a couple more uh, sneaky goblins on that uh, collector or the storage over there I'm trying to communicate or uh, commentate and uh, strategize how to attack this base we are at 41 percent baby dragon here over on the right side and another one over here on the left we will also use i think we have another baby dragon towards the top here 42 percent and we are going to try to go for that town hall now we are at 45 percent so I guess we will drop the baby, uh, balloons over here on the right side and using that blimp with the warden ability right about now to allow for the town halls to go down. We will drop our rates or our freeze on that there and hopefully gain some more for that town hall down. We're at 47%. We will get that first star. We just needed to get that second star, which you will get over here on the left side, it looks like. By dropping that rates but we did run out of time we have this is my first attack in legend league as a town hall 11 so we did pretty good getting 10 trophies from this one here uh as a town hall 11 attacking a town hall 15. and on to the next attack here uh this is a town hall 14 is the first time i've seen this even on my 15 i would never see a town hall 14 but they have the town hall in the direct center of the base so it's going to be a pretty a uh, tough time getting to that town hall but i will try to get the two star in this one here as i did at a town hall 14 we don't have to worry about the monolith and the spell towers so we will drop the queen charge towards the bottom trying to take down the eagle artillery and yeah we'll start the raid towards the bottom here on this laboratory and dropping that queen at charge we have a lot of buildings towards the outside so we could easily get this 50 percent it's just getting that town hall in the center that is going to be a little bit of an issue 
but yeah we're starting towards the bottom here with our queen charge making our way up to the top of the base here uh we'll drop a uh wall break right here to target this wizard tower wall i think we will be able to break open that compartment we need one more before that wizard tower does go down i dropped one by accident over here on the right side we did open up that compartment i'm gonna drop a couple of goblins over here to path the queen back around to target that uh, eagle artillery so just very good we'll drop one more here she won't get targeted by the enemy king and she will take down the eagle artillery we're going to start the uh push over here on the left side for more percentage around the outside of the base and the queen loops back around the outside so she's going to get even more percentage with this queen charge a lot of value with her here two minutes left in this raid i will drop the king towards the top of the base here and a couple more stinky goblins on these two storages over here on the left side going to actually freeze the uh our air defense as the queen takes that down we will drop uh you know we'll let the queen walk around a little bit more to get more percentage on this base we get more trophies the more percentage we get so if you get the two star we'll get a lot of trophies from this one here so you will drop a freeze on this scatter shot i think um, yeah, we'll drop a freeze right now, freezing that to allow for her to use her ability, it looks like. And we'll continue to freeze it to allow for her to get a little bit more percentage before we do actually... I actually forgot to put the king towards the top left. Uh, that's fine. We'll drop a couple baby dragons up here to get more percentage. We'll drop a couple of uh, archers as well on the storages. And we have a minute left in the raid. Already getting the, close to that 50% very easily there. We'll drop a couple more goblins here on the left side uh we could have dropped some on this over here but i guess we could drop a baby dragon instead that tesla did pop up for getting that 50 percent there and i guess we will drop one more over here and i think we don't have any tornado traps in the center so i could go from the very bottom with our blimp we have plenty plenty of time to uh figure this out we will drop the wall break here just because and i guess we'll head in towards the bottom we'll actually drop a couple of minions just a test for that tornado trap and other bombs we did locate that air bomb there so we will drop the balloons with the warden getting that seeking air mine out of the way and dropping the warden ability right about now with a raid spell poison and freeze and everything to allow for that town hall to hopefully go down we are on it and that sneaky goblins are coming on to it and we will get that two star on a town hall 14 getting 60 percent on this one not too bad we're out of time there in this raid we'll see how many trophies we do get from a 60 percent two star as a town hall 11 19 trophies not too bad for the first two star of the day let's head on to another one on to another attack against another town hall 15 let's see if we can get a two star on this one as well the town hall is close to the outside but we have all the heroes and stuff towards the bottom so i'm guaranteeing that a tornado trap is around this area as they have all three both of the uh scatter shots and that monolith down there with all three of the heroes as well so we will probably run into a tornado trap down there now with the queen charge we can't get to the eagle because it is directly in the center of the base so we are going to go from i think the right side to avoid the clan castle so we'll start off on the right side of the base over here and i guess we will try to just path her up maybe even go into the base a little bit here we will drop a couple of wall breaks to open up this compartment here and she will head in eventually i'm pretty sure we will drop a couple of sneaky goblins towards the top here to path her in towards the uh, cannon and stuff towards the bottom of the base uh, we will drop a race spell as well just to speed her through a little bit as she is also getting a little bit low in health and she is pathing towards the bottom which is good she will run into this stuff towards the bottom so she won't get too much percentage unless she does uh luckily pass uh path up towards the top after taking down this archer tower it looks like she will just head directly in towards this mortar and all the way down toward the bottom here so you will have to use a bunch of spells on her just to get a little bit more percentage we don't want to activate the uh, eagle artillery just yet per usual as we don't want that uh, activating and having to target our queen and we won't get too much percentage we are at 16 percent though we will drop our first rage spell here and also freezing that scatter shot to keep her up a little bit longer freezing it once again with that uh, inferno tower as well i should have probably frozen that instead we'll drop a raid spell once again and the last freeze onto that scatter shot and the monolith with that inferno tower getting ready to use our queen ability here 
as we get a ton of stuff targeting her here up to 23%. We'll take down the enemy queen, so that is a plus there, I guess. We've got 23% with her. The eagle isn't activated just yet. We took out those skeletons. We have a minute left in the raid, so we gotta get really going with this army. The clan castle will get lured because of the sneaky goblins being in range there. So we'll drop a bunch of baby dragons towards the bottom. Uh, we'll drop a, uh, we shouldn't drop any balloons just yet. Uh, we need a couple more. We need the king going somewhere as well, I just realized. So we'll drop the king over here. The clan castle is a super Valkyrie and some dragons. So we'll drop that king ability just to get some percentage over here on the right side. A baby dragon there, baby dragon here, and a baby dragon there. We'll drop a couple more goblins as well, up to 38%. We should hopefully get the one star from the town hall, but we could run into that tornado trap, like I said, 34%, and we need a couple more percentage up here. Uh, we can't get that spell tower down, the spell factory down. We'll drop a goblin or two down here, and I guess we go for that town hall now. We have the dragon over here, but I think I will go over towards the right side because the queen was over there. So we'll drop the blimp and everything, getting ready with that raid spell and the warrant ability. We are getting to that town hall, it looks like that uh, sweeper is pushing it back, but it will drop onto it and we will get the two star. Actually, wait, we're gonna run out of time, I just realized. Oh, we got the 50% though. Okay, we got at least one star. We were about to get the second star from that there, but I did run out of time. I should have gone in with that town hall a little bit earlier. But yeah, we almost got that two star on a town hall 15, but let's head on to at least one more attack. Heading on to the final attack of the day, looks like I have two attacks left, but I will do the last one off camera if this one does well. Uh, so I will go from the bottom, obviously, because the town hall uh, is close to the outside with that blimp to get that first star. And the second star, I'm not too sure. The eagle is in the center of the base. We want to get as much percentage with our queen charge. Uh, the heroes are towards the right and left, so I guess we go from the top with our queen charge to start off this raid. The balloon is to find any seeking air mines towards the outside, but it looks like there aren't any out here. We will drop a baby dragon. I don't think we could actually because of the air defenses towards both sides. We'll drop a couple of wall breakers with this raid spell to hopefully open up this compartment here. So we'll open that up. The queen will head in and take down most of this. Maybe even hopefully get that eagle out of the way. We're gonna have to drop another raid spell, looks like, as the skeletons and stuff are distracting the queen. Two and a half minutes left in the raid. We're gonna find a decent spot to drop our king once the queen uh, works its way over to that eagle artillery. I guess we could drop it towards the right here to uh, like get some more percentage going. The queen is gonna go up against that bomb tower, maybe even up to that eagle artillery afterwards. We'll drop that raid spell there. It looks like she will go around. So we'll drop another wall break here to see if she does go over to that eagle artillery after taking down these couple of collectors over here. Uh, the eagle is almost activated, so we'll use the king's ability here over on the right side, getting a couple more percentages. And it looks like the queen is going up against that expo. We'll freeze that there, and hopefully the queen loops over to the right side after that goes down. We're going to have to use the freeze on the royal champ and the queen's ability, and we need the queen to go over. There we go. She'll go over and take out the eagle artillery so we can do a little bit more damage around the outside of the base without having to worry about the, uh, uh, what's it called, the eagle artillery. We're going to have to drop a poison and a freeze on this here for that clan castle there. And we'll head on to get the 50% here on this Town Hall 15. We have a bunch of stuff towards the outside of value that we can get. And continuing on with our sneaky goblins going all the way around the outside of the base. Baby Dragon right about there. And one more here. One minute left in the raid. We gotta get going for this 50% here. We'll get another goblin here, another baby dragon there. Uh, baby dragon here to get that archer out of the way. And the minions are taken care of with that poison spell and everything. And another baby dragon over here. 41%. It looks like we aren't probably going to get the 50% uh, here. I will drop, uh, actually we'll drop the goblins with the uh, rest of the stuff here. So we'll drop the balloons over here on the right side with the warden and the blimp. We'll drop a raid spell with that ability and the wall break and then using the rest of the goblins going to freeze the back end to allow for us to get the 50% two star and there we go getting our second two star 
of the day with 15 seconds left in the raid. We'll see how many trophies you do get from the 50% two star on a maxed or somewhat maxed Town Hall 15. 16 trophies, not too bad there. And doing this final attack, we have this base design here with the Town Hall, the Clan Castle, and the heroes and everything basically towards the very bottom, baiting you to go directly from here to take down that Town Hall. We are going to have a little bit of issue going for that there. We are going to go from the outside uh, with our queen at charge. Uh, we'll go from the left side here with our queen at charge and dropping a baby dragon down here to path the queen up to the top right of the base. She will take down the spell factory there and the other one here. And we will head up towards the top with our queen at charge here. Uh, she will head up towards the top right. We will have to drop a wall break at some point. I think our wall breakers will be able to break these Town Hall 12 walls, raging the queen up here. Wall breaking in right about here. We see if we can do it. I'm pretty sure we can, and there we go. We will wall break in with a single wall breaker, getting a bunch of value in with our queen charge here, up to 15% by just dropping a baby dragon. And I think, actually, we just dropped a baby dragon and nothing else. Uh, we have another raid spell ready to go with another wall break, which you will drop here to open up to this next compartment. Two minutes left in the raid, we'll drop the king towards the top and getting ready with another raid spell here to get her back up to full health. And we'll get ready with going with more goblins towards the outside and going to freeze that uh, warden there. And another couple of wall breaks over here and another freeze on that warden. Another wall break here over on the left side. King's ability being used towards the top. Getting a ton of value with our queen charge here. And we'll drop another freeze on that eagle as she will probably go down to uh, the stuff towards the bottom, like those expos and uh, the ER artillery. We're up to 40, uh, 36%. And we still have to drop a bunch of our goblins, which we don't have too much value. We have a bunch of storages down here towards the bottom. And we'll see if we can take down this clan castle down here with the five remaining goblins. And it looks like we will, very good. And we can hopefully push our way in to getting that 50% uh, with the rest of our baby dragons, the blimp and the uh, balloons here. If we go up to 42%, another baby dragon, the last one dropping there. And we don't really have anywhere else to drop the archers and minions. So we'll drop the balloons down here on this bomb tower, the archers, the minions, and using the blimp with this rage spell here, the warden ability there, and we'll drop our poison spell for these air skeletons as we drop it onto the town hall to hopefully get this town hall down. The goblins are taking it out and we get another two star 50% very very good for the final attack of the day we end off this raid here seeing how many trophies we do get again 16 trophies not too bad there after finishing the eight attacks we end off the day at 5024 trophies which is 15 above where we started today at 5009 trophies if we check our battle log we still have five hours and three minutes left in the league day but we were attacked twice on defense and they three starred us both times because they were tunnel 15 and they use everything to destroy my village but on offense we got 95 trophies getting three two stars four one stars which are pretty close to getting two stars on but i did get one zero star but for a plus four trophy which is still a gain but that was a pretty bad attack for my sixth attack of the day so still a plus 15 for the day we still have five hours like i said so we still could get attacked on defense for six more times so we could get kicked out of legend league by the end of the day but still a decent time in legend league at the town hall 11. that's gonna do it for today hope you enjoyed it and if you did want to see some more town hall 11 pushing content check with the plays i have linked on the screen now thank you guys for watching and i'll see you in the next one peace out